The post pagination widget makes browsing easier by allowing smooth navigation between post pages. It enhances the user experience with seamless transitions and easy access to additional content. Let's get started. Before getting started, make sure you have the Unlimited Elements free version installed and activated on your WordPress website. Then, head over to Unlimited Elements, Widgets, and use the search bar to find Post Pagination. Hover over it and click Install to add the widget to your site. Similarly, install any post widget from the widget library. For this tutorial, we'll use the Post Grid widget, but you can use any post widget of your choice. Next, Go to the page you want to edit and drag and drop both the post grid and post pagination widgets from the widgets pane onto your Elementor canvas. Select the desired post type and post terms you want to display. Then, customize the design by styling the widget according to your layout. To connect both widgets, go to the Post Pagination and Filtering option. From the Pagination dropdown, choose Using Pagination Widget. Enable post filtering and configure the filter's behavior based on your needs. In the general settings, enable the Show All option to display all pagination pages. Note that enabling this will disable the midsize and end size options, and it's only available in the Pro version. For the midsize setting, enter the number of page links to display on either side of the current page. Similarly, the end size controls the number of links shown at the beginning and end of the pagination. You can also select Force Format and Force Non-Ajax if your setup requires specific pagination behavior. Enable the display of previous and next buttons. This feature is only available in the Pro version. Show or hide the text labels for the previous and next buttons. Enter custom text for the previous and next links if needed. Additionally, you can enable or disable icons for the buttons and choose suitable icons for both the previous and next buttons. Once you've added the content, you can start configuring the widget style settings to match your design needs. Adjust the pagination alignment, border radius, page numbers margin, border width, and more to ensure the post pagination widget seamlessly integrates with your website's design. To wrap up the video, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more awesome tutorials. Start using unlimited elements and give your Elementor website superpowers. We can't wait to see you in the next video. Thanks for joining us and see you next time.